Hey everybody, Air Tracker Nature Films here on the Eel River. Looking around on the bank and there's something kind of cool right here. So I'm wading across to show you this. So what it looks like happened here is a gray fox came down to the water and it stopped here for a minute to drink. And then it went back up the bank right up there. But what's really interesting is I think I see an otter scat up there. So I want to go up there and see if that's an otter scat. There's what might be an old track over here, but I don't see a lot of good obvious otter tracks. So it could be old. Definitely a gray fox was here. Came down to the water to drink right here. You can see the footprints here where it paused to drink. And you can see where it came down to the water right over here. If I move the tree. And then right here you can see where it went back up. So let's go in there and see what's there. So it doesn't look like an entire otter latrine, but there is at least one otter scat in here. This is a raised ridge right here from a mole. See how that goes around in here? And there's a raised ridge. So there's one otter scat. Something right there. Cool. This is the world of the otter down here. We're underneath all the brush. This is where they live. There's the fox tracks going that way. So this otter scat looks like it's full of uh, maybe crayfish. Looks like maybe some fish scales in there. I'm going to get the close-up camera out and we'll see. Okay, so if you're an otter, this is part of your menu right here. These orange bits are parts of a crayfish, and I broke them apart so you could see it. Um, just kind of an idea of what's on the menu for an otter here on the Eel River. This other stuff doesn't want to break apart. That one. Looks like there might be some legs in here, some parts from a... Maybe dragonfly naiads, I'm not sure about that. Right here. Anyway, this is an otter, river otter scat. And it looks like this one at least that I can confirm ate a crayfish. Also called a crawdad. And uh, they love those things. Um, the Eel River does have them, they're hard to find. But uh, if you're a human. But if you're an otter, you find these things really easily. And um, that's what's on their menu, so at least for this otter in particular. And I uh, hope you've enjoyed looking at the uh, a, a small part of the world of the river otter on the Eel River.